This is a strength and conditioning workout for boxing. Welcome to Boxing Science. In this video, we're taking new boxing science recruit, Dan Toward, through a strength and conditioning workout for boxing. Dan's quite new to strength and conditioning, so we're just working on the basic exercises. So if you are a beginner or an intermediate athlete, this is a perfect workout for you. We're going to be developing the strong foundations in terms of his jumping, punch specific work, trap bar deadlifts, getting them to a decent level, but we're looking to optimize how to express force and how to hold your posture under heavy loads. And then we're doing push, pull, single leg, and a range of core exercises to finish. So if you've got any questions about any of the exercises used, please leave them in the comment box below and I hope they enjoy the workout. So box jumps and then altitude landings on the other side. Dip down, hips come back, knees bent, swing them arms back and through, float onto the box, try landing on the other side, yeah? Good. So you're going a little bit too quick. You're like, <coughs> and then trying to get onto the box. Wanting to load it up, load, drive, float onto the box, right. yeah? Yeah, yeah? When you land, let's get a little bit deeper onto that landing. Land into yeah, this yeah. position. Good. Well, you just lost that counter movement there. A stretch and shorten. Yeah, right. so you're stretching, holding, and then going. That's better. Well done. Good. Yeah, good. A little bit lower on the landing. That's the best one you've done so far. And we're landing onto heels. Brilliant. Drop down, excellent. Good, over here, mate. Dip your hips, drive it across, opposite arm, opposite leg. Med ball punches. I want you to dip down to use your legs. Drive it through, admire your punch. Fly through, but I want you to hold that position just to get that yeah, yeah. chain sequence in rather than people just trying to rag it and bring the arms across, bringing your head across. <laughs> Good, don't rush it. Dip first, then go. <laughs> yeah, lovely. Well done. And turn that back foot. <laughs> Good, screw that back foot into the floor. <laughs> Whoa! There we go, that's a sweet spot there. <laughs> lovely. Lovely, well done. Good. See that one, you threw across yourself. That's why I'm trying to get you to admire your shot. Drop down, hold. Yeah, it's still punching across you. But uh, we ask you to go down in a straight line. The first thing that you do is you take that foot up, actually have a step, mm. rather than just keeping stationary. So that's yeah, the first yeah. thing. Dip. No movement in the feet. Yep. Because we're widening the stance even more. You've got quite wide stance anyway, but once you start widening it there, that's going to really affect like kind of that power. And you can mm -hmm. see actually to try and get that power through, you're actually having to drag that back, back foot. foot. Yeah. Look at that back foot. So when I'm saying to try and admire your shot at the end, you're coming across yourself, which is affecting that rotational power. Knee and your foot is dragging in, which is affecting that hip extension forces. Yeah, yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Getting more power now. Lovely. You're still getting that little step. That's a little tendency to step there. You're driving it through more from your hips now. Yeah. Look at your way back foot's finishing compared to the your back foot's like kind of dragging all the way and where your knee's going right beyond your hips. Yeah. Knee just wants to be online with the hips or just behind. Yeah, nice. Three, good. Four, good. One more. Lovely stuff, well done, really good to meet. Like how you're standing up in between, just giving you that chance to reset. You're treating it like it's five singles, which is really good. Good, somewhat tense. Good, no movement. Just pinch those shoulders just that little bit more. That's better. 
Tight grip. Yeah, nice. Good, two more. Good. One more. Yeah, nice work, well done. So it's most likely you've lifted over five reps, so. In our data, we've seen that 32% of people that watch this channel actually subscribe to the Boxing Science YouTube channel. That means a massive 68% aren't currently subscribed. So if you're part of that group, if you could hit the subscribe button so that helps support the Boxing Science channel, help it grow so we can give you even better content. There we go, better straight there, good. Brilliant, well done. Yeah, nice. Pull back on them shoulders. Yep. Lovely, well done. You gotta be aggressive with those hips at the top, yeah? Yeah, yeah. oh, 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 oh. Yeah, nice. Good, pause at the top. Yeah, a little bit long, pause. Three, two, one, yeah, and one, eight reps, yeah? The TRX VI isometric hold at the top, yeah? Good. A little bit slower going down and keep that chest up. We don't want to round your shoulders as you go down. That's it. That's it, good, and transitioning to each rep. Good. That's great, well done.